I'm making breakfast and coffee. We're having pancakes. I'm very excited. Tardis is also very excited because he will get a puppy cake. I've decided to finally take care of my laundry. Um, it's only been sitting here for a full week. And <laughs> I kind of feel bad about it, so now I'm doing it. This is probably cringeworthy for people watching, but uh, when I put my socks up, I don't bunch them or anything. <laughs> they just get thrown in my drawer. I'll show you. They go in just like this, right next to my bathing suit tops, because I also don't organize my drawers. Yeah. Sorry, Amy! <laughs> Good morning, everyone. So, our schedule's been a little bit off since Thursday. Um, so today's Sunday, and we will be going grocery shopping. Guys, look at this. This is amazing, and I got it for Angela's grandma. Grandma, grandma, wave. Hi. While I was cleaning, I came across the most amazing find. I've been looking for these photos for so long. So first off, we have the senior photos. And this is my friend Melissa. And we have uh, Emily, Caitlin, and Maddie. This is one of my favorites. It's Emily with one of our favorite teachers, Mr. Wolford. Oh, God, I miss him. We have another one of Maddie. I think this is TJ's graduation party. This is from our prom. Uh, that's Emily in one of the fun, like, sticky suits. They had a wall of, like, Velcro set up that you would run and jump onto. I don't remember what this one is. Maybe it was Amy's graduation party, but that's our friend Thomas Dumar in a wetsuit. <laughs> I love this one. It's Amy and Tom Fenton. Hey, hey! This is one from our high school graduation. It's got Jackie, me, Emily, her boyfriend at the time, now husband Mike, Amy, and our friend Bridget. Amy in her prom dress. The one time, I believe, I've ever seen Amy in a dress in our entire lives. Now we have a couple more graduation ones right back to back. Thumbs up with our diplomas. <laughs> me, like, modeling for some reason. I still have that tank top. I can go get it. I can show it to you. Here's one of Amy, Emily, and Mike at the after party, I believe, of prom. Here's one of my other favorite people. It's Mrs. Zaya. I miss her. I want to hang out. You, your husband, and me, and Amy, and all of our friends should get food again. Was a very scandalous photo. I got in some trouble for this one. But it's me and my friend Jackie. Uh, yeah, I still have that dress. I love that dress. I refuse to part with it. <laughs> this is Chassie. Her actual name is Cassie, but we call her Chassie. And I miss her. And we went to Suko together for a little while. This is our friend Freddie. He's married now and does not have an afro in that. Just the afro part makes me sad. I'm very happy for him. This is one from Dumar's birthday party. We went to Water Safari and we all took a photo in this giant chair. Here's a photo of me and Amy from prom with my bangin' dress and Amy's bangin' dress and our, like, we don't wear makeup or do hair, so we're just going to do this style. Here's a photo of Bridget and Emily from when Amy was doing, what video was that? They were doing a music video. This takes me back, the original couch photo. Oh, God. Me, Amy, TJ, and our friend Brittany recreated this photo not that long ago. But this is the OG, guys. It's the first couch photo. We are literally all sitting on top of Tommy. That is us with Mr. Bliss when we graduated high school with his fun Spongebob tie. This is a small version of us meeting Martin Short. And we were so upset with the girl that took this photo because everything's out of focus. But we crack up every time because this guy was so mad at us. 
He was the coordinator for the event, and we were not supposed to get backstage to meet Martin Short. But I was not about to miss out on meeting my, like, one of 1,200 husbands, okay? This is us with Mrs. Z's son, who we call Little Dude, who's not so little anymore. <laughs> this one's from Dumar's birthday party. We were on the Tilt-A-Whirl for like an hour and a half, and this guy was such a good dude about it that we were like, can we get a photo with you? <laughs> this is Celine, who is my friend's daughter, who I haven't seen in so long, and now she's like 12. And this is her and Jade. That's my photo collection that I found that I've been looking for for so long. And I was so upset with myself because I was like, how did you lose these? How did you lose all these very important photographs? I found them. I didn't lose them. I put them up for safekeeping and then forgot where I put them. Update of the freaking century. Guys, it still fits. <laughs> what? It For a long time, I couldn't wear it at all. Like, I was really depressed about it. I was so upset because I was, well, I deal with some body image issues and I have dealt with eating disorder trouble and stuff, but the, the fact that I could not fit into this dress gave me such bad anxiety because it was literally not even a year later I couldn't fit into it. And that, what? What? Are you serious? Oh my god, maybe I'm not giving it up. Maybe I'm going to keep it forever. <laughs> I have to go over to my parents' house and drop off Tardy Poo. So once I drop him off, I have to go over to Amy's and we're going to the dump, which is a thing that I didn't know existed, <laughs> which is crazy because we've been friends since third grade, so that's like 16, 17 years. How did I not know this was a thing? So we're going there and we're going to do some treasure hunting. Are you ready to go see your Mima? Are you ready to go see Mima and get treats from a grandma? Because you know she's going to give them to you. He's very excited.